My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. Wow, we have got a stunning car right here. A 1972 Le Mans Sport Convertible. Now keep in mind, they did not make a GTO convertible in 1972. That's why this is a Le Mans Sport. It has all the GTO features, but they did not make the GTO in 72. But anyway, this thing has 1,500 miles on a nut and bolt body off frame rotisserie restoration. Very detailed itemized invoices here, pictures of the restoration. This thing's meticulous. The guy I bought it from owned this car 34 years. It was very personal to him. He had an emotional day the day I bought it from him. But the attention to detail really shows. There's a lot of frame off restored cars out there. This one's exceptional, really nice. It's got a performance built 455, performance built of a turbo 400. It's got four wheel disc brakes, got a rebuilt Posi, uh, air conditioned car, all sorts of good stuff going for it. Go to volocars.com. That's where you can read the specs, see the pictures top to bottom. And that's where you'll find the price, not only on this one, but we do have a few hundred collector cars and they're all for sale at volocars.com. If you just enjoy watching our video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on the bell icon and you'll be notified as the new ones are posted. But for right now, the top's down. Join me for a spin in the 72 Pontiac. Yeah, I mean, I don't need to say much there. This thing is just slick. Got the billet rally two wheels, the bright color, the spoiler, it's hot. If you look underneath the car, it's just as slick. The body shop invoice was about $47,000. It's very detailed, step by step, what they did with this car. But it was, uh, body was, first they, they fitted everything. While it was on the body, they made sure all the gaps and everything were square. They spent a lot of time just making everything fit just right. Then they took the whole car apart, took it off the frame. Underneath the car, they just put a whole one-piece floor pan in there. It looks like the factory did it at the factory seams, and it's all new metal. They painted it the same gloss orange underneath. The whole frame and chassis was taken apart, stripped down, and powder-coated a semi-gloss black. So everything's rebuilt. The, all the front end bushings, ball joints, shocks, springs, you name it, front and back, completely rebuilt or replaced. All the steering components are replaced. It's a turbo 400 rebuilt by BMB Transmissions. I have the specs on that, it's performance built. Uh, the rear end uh, has a new Auburn uh, Posi unit, uh, re uh, Richmond rebuild kit that's all gone through. Uh, the rear end was stripped down, painted beautifully. Uh, the exhaust system was custom made, installed in the car, then it was taken back out and it was sent out for ceramic coating. So beautiful fat exhaust, crossover pipe, uh, Flowmaster mufflers, and it has the chrome splitter tips. The Pontiac splitter tips are tucked up behind the rear quarter panels there. Fuel systems all new, the tank, the straps with the insulators, the lines, uh, all that's new. Four wheel disc brakes all the way around. I think they're Willwood disc brakes. Big calipers. I don't know if they're Willwood or not. Something force it says, but uh, drilled rotors, big calipers. So underneath the car is brand new down to the last nut and bolt and clip. The body is amazing. It was a professional high end shop. And again, they fit this car like brand new. It is laser beam straight from every angle. And it was given this gorgeous uh, orange finish. Now, anyone who's ever known these cars or owned these cars, there's a factory seam right here. And all the convertibles from flexing will crack. There's a hairline on each corner, just a hairline crack. They're going to do that no matter what you do. Uh, and obviously, as a rear spoiler, and like I was saying earlier, these are actually billet aluminum Rally 2 wheels. They're gorgeous, even up close. They're just pristine. 
Uh, he has BF Goodrich, no, Nitto Extreme ZR Performance tires. And every piece of trim, the stainless is polished out like chrome, the door handles, the rubber seals, uh, the windshield's new, has a hood-mounted tachometer. The Le Mans Sport has this really good-looking front end with the nose and the scoops and the vents on the fenders. And everything up here, the grills, all that's restored real nicely. Four fifty five motor, performance built, Edelbrock aluminum heads, Edelbrock intake, Edelbrock carb with electric choke. Uh, it has fancy fittings and braided fuel line, uh, an MSD ignition system, it's got headers. Uh, the front of the motor has the March uh, brackets and billet pulleys with the serpentine belt, chrome alternator. Two things not finished on the car, the air conditioning. Everything under the dash is rebuilt. The heater box was all taken apart and rebuilt. It's all in the invoices. So all the parts for the air conditioning are there. They just didn't finish it. We have a shop that can finish it if you purchase the car and it's something you want done. It has a Be Cool aluminum radiator with dual electric fans to keep the car running cool. Uh, it has braided stainless transmission lines. <clears throat> The white interior is all redone, and what I notice, it's all the same color. You don't have mismatched headrests, mismatched backs, and mismatched armrests. It's all the same color. The seats were rebuilt. They feel like new seats. The cushion's real nice. All the chrome trim, all of it. Everything in here is all the same. Uh, it's like an off-white color. The dash pad was actually sent out to Just Dashes in California. That's all they do, obviously, Just Dashes. The dash is redone like new, and everything, the vents, the bezels, the lenses, the knobs, the machine turn trim, all of that looks like new. It's gorgeous in here. The door jams are painted just as slick as the car. You got power brakes, power steering. The steering is chromed. Wiper motor looks new has a, an overflow bottle, a billet overflow bottle hidden back there. White convertible top is new, and the whole top frame was taken apart and fitted and painted and new weather strips made real nice. Trunk compartment too, which will knock that out. All clean metal. This is painted beautifully. The jam, the weather strip has a new well liner that's just painted black. I'll get a mat in here and we can spatter paint this. He has all these speaker wires. He had a temporary stereo just sitting in the car. He left the wires, so that's one more item not done. There's the factory hole in the dash. He didn't want to cut it. He didn't know what the next person would want. So the air conditioning and the radio are two items that are unfinished. If you're buying it at our sticker price, we will finish those things. Uh, so talk to the salesman about that. Uh, in the trunk, I'll throw a mat in here and, and we'll tidy up those wires, depending on what you do with the stereo. Uh, it's got the rally gauges in the dash, has uh, quartz movement in the clock, has owner's manuals in the glove box, a new formula wheel on a tilt column. Uh, the GM seat belts, they're either restored or they're new reproduction, but they're beautiful. It has power windows. This is just an exciting car. I drove this car home, too. Drove really well. Doesn't that just sound nice? Not too much, not too little. Visors look redone, the mirror's new. That's a nice sounding motor. Just look how they got the stance just right, how it's lowered down, those wheels are killer. Been trying to buy this car for about a month.
The day he brought it out, he had a hard time letting it go. He owned it for 30-something years, and he put all his blood, sweat, and energy into making it what it is. And it has under 1,500 miles since it was done. Uh, this is an above and beyond type restoration. This is nicer than most. It's an exceptional car. Someone's going to love owning this car. That's my opinion. Go to volocars.com. There's plenty of ways to contact the salesman. They will answer questions or concerns you might have. They can also get you financed. They can get this shipped anywhere in the country. So go to volocars.com before someone beats you to this one. If you just enjoy watching the video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on that bell icon, and you'll be the first to see the next video posted. Thanks for watching.